You're watching an indie game show production. From the Game Shows Unlimited Studios at Mill Basin Day Camp, it's the Game Show Block Party with Bill Manners and Mark Kirk. Hey, I'm Phil the Media Guy, and I'm Mark, and we're all dressed up. Ready for another episode of the Game Show Block Party. That's right, we are. Don't forget. Watch! It's the card game of highs and lows from the Mill Basin Day Camp Game Show Studio. It's time for Las Vegas Winning Streak with our host, Art Kurtz. Thank you, and we have two people to play our game. They're going to play for $250 in prizes if you get to play the dice, and also a chance to win $10,000 in cash with a lottery ticket that Mike will scratch off for you, and you get to keep any cash it wins. Oh. It's up to $599, we'll pay you right now. Oh! <laughs> we'll get to that a little later. Oh, well. Right <laughs> now, who needs, that who needs that bonus game? We're gonna get to the bonus game a little later. Okay. Uh, right now, we're gonna play cards. Okay. Now, the way the game works is uh, you have to tell me if the next card is higher or lower than the card before it. In our game, twos are the lowest, aces are the highest. Oh. To play your cards, you have to win a question, and to win a question, I will ask a question with a number. Where are my questions? Sorry, there I they are. Lost those two. Yeah, there they are. Okay. And here's your first question. Meet How many people? people? Meet the people. You never even met the people. Oh, I didn't meet them. Good way to go. Okay, well, we have playing the red, we have uh, Danielle, and playing the blue, we have Jacqueline. Jacqueline. Yes. Did I say that right? Yes. Tell me about your name and how you got that name, Jacqueline. Well, well I think um, I was named after my parents' trip to parent, uh, Paris, um, but they spelled it differently. Yeah, Jacqueline, that's really interesting. Did you ever go to Paris? No, but we, but we did go to a place very close to Paris. Where is that? Uh, I think we went to Prague or something. Okay, all right. Well, that's good. Jacqueline, good to meet you. Thank you. You want to say hello to anybody at uh, school? Uh, I don't know. I don't think anybody in my family watches Channel 68, so oh, not well, really. <laughs> there goes that. <laughs> And we play Danielle, how are you? How did you get your name? Um, uh, my, my mom never told me. Oh. No? <laughs> you yeah. didn't go to Paris? I, I just stayed here. Speak in, in the microphone, the people. I just stayed in, like, New York for the rest of my life. I went to Pennsylvania, <laughs> New Jersey. <laughs> That's it. That's it. What do you do <laughs> when you go to Jersey? I just visit my cousins there and my aunt. Okay. Her name's Jackie. Oh, close to her name, right? Uh, yeah. Sort of. Uh, would you like to say hello to them? Maybe they're watching on the internet? I think I'm going to say hello to my teacher. I think she's watching it. Hi, Miss McCabe. What, Miss who? Miss McCabe. Miss McCabe. Uh -huh. From what school? PS52. PS52 on uh, our... Nostrand Avenue, right? Uh, Sheep Shed Bay. Yes, yes. All right. Now we're going to be ready to start the game. You both got your cards. You both uh, have five cards. You cut your cards, right? Yeah. You told us where to stop uh, them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The player who turns over their last card will win the game, and you do that by telling me if the next card is higher or lower. Ooh. But yeah. life is flashing by. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And I'm going to give the first question. We always start with the blue player. You'll give yeah. me a number. Jacqueline yes. and Danielle, or you like Danielle or Danny? Um, I like Danny. We'll that's call you Danny? Uh, that's my short, that's my like Like short. Art is my short name. Okay. Yeah, my mom met Real you. Name. Yes, okay. <laughs> ah, it's been so long I found that question. Yes, so it's Art. So my longer name, we won't tell you, but people can figure it out. Here is uh, your first question, and Jacqueline, you'll answer it, and then Danny, you'll say higher or lower. Okay. How many people are there in the U.S. House of Representatives? Uh, okay, yes, those are the congressmen. Uh, I don't know the congressmen in this neighborhood. Does anyone know? I know who it was, but he's not in. How many people are there in the House of Representatives, Congress? 
I'm guessing 153. 153. Now, someone gets it right in the nose. We'll hear bells, and it's, we don't hear bells, so that means da uh, Danny. You get to tell me if it's higher or lower. I think it's a. Little... And everybody can help. I think it's um higher. Higher, she says. The she said higher, right? Yes. Okay. Just now my mic's it. working too, because Danielle's mic is really high. Overtime. She said, I'm "Working overtime." She said higher. The number of people in the U.S. House of Representatives is 435. Wow, it is higher. Oh. Danny, you get to play your card first, and that's the red card. I turn it over. You have a seven. When you win a question, you could change your card. Do you want to change the seven to the next card on the top of the deck? Listen to Allison. Or you could keep what? the seven. What you happens if I change it? I give you the next card instead. Listen to Allison. Uh, you can keep the seven or change it. What do you want to do, Danny? Change you want to keep the seven or change it? Change it, change it, change it, change it, change it, change it, change it. Ron is waiting out there. Keep it. You're keeping it, okay, after all that. Oh my god. Higher or lower than seven, Danny? Lower than seven, going a little against the odds. It is, oh, it was Ooh. higher. Wait, I don't know Sorry. about jacks. I don't jacks. know if jacks are higher. What happened? I don't know about jacks, though. I don't know if they're higher or lower. They're oh, higher. Lower they're that. higher. It was, I don't know if the jacks. It was uh, higher, and you said, lo you said oh, lower. So Jacqueline gets a free shot at the 10. Lower. Higher or lower than 10? Oh, um, lower. Lower. Lower than a 10. An ace. No. Oh! At least we both got it wrong. <laughs> we have Genius. to replace those cards. And we're going to go to another question. And this time, Danny, you get the question. Okay, you ready for your question? Uh, How many South. countries are there in South America? How many countries are, have you ever been to South America? I never. But how many countries do you think there are? You know, we're in North America. So? How many countries do you think are there in South America? Don't go away, just tell the people um, how many countries. She's uh, looking to leave. <laughs> I'm not looking to leave, I'm just trying to think it through by oh, doing okay. uh, I'm doing math in my head. I usually America? do that if there's a really hard problem. Shh. She's doing math in her head. She's trying to figure it out. How many countries are there? I say... Oh my... I say 78. Seventy-eight. Do you think it's higher or lower? Lower. The number of countries in South America is fifteen. Fifteen. You had a lot of countries there. Fifteen. So Jacqueline uh, wins the question. Jacqueline, you wait, can change the ten if you want. I don't understand it. Since um, South America is a bigger state than North America, how can it be? How no. can I have a smaller number of countries? It, it had 70, yeah, it had, uh, how many? 15. 15. Yeah. They're big countries, big countries. Have little, yeah. have little, oh, okay, now I get it. Now you got it. So Jacqueline plays the card. Jacqueline, you have the 10. Change. 10? I want you to change it. She's changing the 10. It becomes a 5. Uh, about the oh. same, maybe. No, maybe not. Higher or lower than five? Um, I think... Higher or lower? Uh, higher? Higher? 
Higher, she says, it's a 10. Now, you could freeze or you could keep playing. Uh, I'll keep playing. I think it's the first time we got off the first card. I know. Yep. Higher or lower than 10? Lower. Lower, oh, you, you're keeping, you're playing on, you said lower. Oh, careful with that. <laughs> lower than a 10, it's, oh, no, a jack. Danny, you get to s play your seven, higher or lower. You can't change it. Uh, I say... Higher or lower than seven? Higher. Say it in the mind. I didn't hear you. Higher. She says higher than a seven. It's a ten. Yeah. Yeah. Play on or freeze? Uh, Dang, she, lo she lost this. Right, she lost that 10. That goes down. Playing on. Higher or lower than a 10? Lower. Lower. Lower, she says no. Oh, oh wow. I was close, though. The cards are tough. All right, we replace the two cards for each. Two cards replaced, and... This is very hard. The next question goes to... Who gets the next question? Uh, I do. Jacqueline. This, these, are, these, these are things we haven't even learned about. Well, it's just a guess. It's a number. Okay. And then this is the third question. It goes to Jacqueline. Okay. Jacqueline. Jacqueline. Yes, yes. How many... You ever listen to the radio? I do. You do? How many radio stations, different radio stations, are there in the whole United States? Um, what do you think? I think 100. 100. Danny, is it higher or lower than 100? Lower. Lower. The number of radio stations in the whole United States are... 13,977. Wow. Oh, my God. A lot of radio stations. Oh, my God. All right. So you was win, it, Jacqueline. I what? You I win did? the question. You could change the seven. Change the five. Oh, that's right. That's blue. You could um, change the five. Keep it. Keep it. Higher or lower than five? Higher. Higher than five is six. You can freeze or you can play on. Play on. Higher or lower than six? Higher. Lower. 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 Higher. Lower. 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 Danny, you still have your seven. Higher or lower? You can't change it. You didn't win a question. Oh. I don't think Danny won any questions yet. Oh, she did. Oh, but you kept the seven. Yep. Higher or lower? I say... Danny? Lower. Lower? Uh-huh. Lower. Danny says lower. Yeah. Lower, lower than a seven. No. Oh. Eight. Dang. Ladies, you've been here forever. We need her. But this is our last question. Somebody has to win now. Okay, because it's the fourth question, we call it sudden death. Somebody has to win, so it's important to win the question. And that question goes to Danny, right? Yes, sir. Danny! Uh-oh. Then you get to say higher or lower. Danny, here's your question. Yes. As of last... The last year when we were taping this, 2011, that was the last time they checked. As of 2011, how many moons did the planet Jupiter have? Or does it have? As of the last time they checked, 2011, how many moons does Jupiter have? Ladies, please sit down. We don't want to block the camera. Wa I actually watched a science movie with my brother and sister, so I think I know this, but I, but I have to remember, so everyone has to be quiet. Aha! Danny wants to concentrate. Can you tell us again? You watched a science movie. 
It, ab about it, Jupiter. Yeah, it's, it's, I have to watch with my brother and sister. It's on Cubo Channel. It's called Jula Patrol. And it, and it was about Jupiter? It's about, it's about space. Okay. So how many <laughs> moons as of 2000, uh, the year 2011, did Jupiter have? I say 16. She says 16 moons. Is it higher or lower than 16? Lower! She says lower. I think you might be surprised. The number of moons that Jupiter had. 63. 63! Oh my God! Wow, so Danny, Danny, you won the question. Let me explain the game. Shh, this is important. Danny, you won the question. And you have a seven. Now, this was the last question of the game. You don't have to play. You could pass. Here's why. If you play Danny, you have to get all four cards. If you make one mistake, Jacqueline wins the game. Of course, you could I pass. I want to pass. Okay. Huh? Smart move. <laughs> Smart move. <laughs> what is that? What? Okay, she's going to force Jacqueline. Jacqueline, if you get them all right, you win. But, but if you, she passed to you because she won the question. No, no. Uh, Go ahead. Uh, this could work out for you. You could win the game. I'm not that Higher smart. Higher or lower than a five? Danny went into the isolation booth. High. Higher or lower than five? She says higher than a five. An ace! Keep going. Higher or lower than an ace? Lower. Lower than an ace. A jack! Higher or lower than a jack? <laughs> lower. Lower. Lower? Yes. She said lower than a jack. Yes! <laughs> Jacqueline! If you get the next card, you win the game. If not, what if I don't? Danny wins the game. What? Okay. Higher or lower than a three? Higher! If it's higher than a three, then Jacqueline wins the game. Jacqueline. Higher, 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 higher. If it's higher, lower, higher. Danny wins. Higher! Higher than a three. Yes! <laughs> Danny, you played well. You played very well. Back with the bonus game, he is Jacqueline to win all those prizes. The New York Blood Center to save lives in our area. There's nothing better than watching the home team knock one out of the park. Now we're hoping that you do the same. Join the team and hit a home run for our community by donating blood. One pint of blood can save up to three lives and mean the difference between life and death for a neighbor. Call the number below or visit the website to schedule your time to give the gift of life. The New York Yankees, the New York Blood Center, and the whole community. We're back. We're back with Jacqueline. You won. That was a good game. And Danny is there rooting you on. She's cheering you on over there. <laughs> Thank you, Danny. All right. All you have to do here is pick numbers, stay away from the stop sign. And if you find, I'm going to give you, uh, oh, I had them, and here they are. I'm going to give you one of these right now. And if you find two more, you'll play the dice game. Could be worth $250 in prizes and a lottery ticket. You need three of those. Now, if you find the stop sign, you lose everything. Pick a number. Eight. Eight. Has uh, eight? Well, it had two things, but it has the green. That's good. So you have, you have at least uh, two now. Oh, you have two. Find one more, you'll play the dice. Find the stop sign. You, if you find the stop sign, the game is over, and you stop. Okay, what does the stop sign look like? A stop sign. It says stop. Okay. <laughs> Maybe in French. No. Uh, I choose. Hmm. 
Seven. Seven. I hope it's good. Seven. Oh! <laughs> now, if you stop now, you play the dice game. I'll stop! We're going to play the dice game for the first time this year, and we'll be back to do it right after this. <laughs> Game Show contestants will receive a gift pack from True Citrus Products. True Lemon, True Lime, and True Orange. Flavor your beverages and spice up your food with True Citrus Products. They're in these convenient packets and shakers. This is my teenage friend Rachel. She's cool. Hey. Hey, could you watch the road? Hey, could you watch the road? Okay. All right, well, if we die in a car crash, I want to donate my eyes to my neighbor, Gary. He has a boat, and he sails all around the world. I would love to see that. I don't know if he actually needs eyes, but who would turn on a free pair of eyes, right? <laughs> Who's that rich? The ladies took so long to play that game. It's like one long game. Are they game is still here rooting you on? So Alex, let's come back another time and play. Special council game I thought we're going to get in, but you're going to help here. Because we always like Allison on our shows. Yeah, uh, Yes, that's nice, isn't that? Yes. She's going to help you win $250 in prizes right now, and maybe a chance of $10,000 in cash. <laughs> okay? Now, the game is really easy. Really, really easy. Yeah. All you do is roll these dice. I'm going to roll right here. And I rolled... I can't even see what I rolled. There. can't see because you... I rolled... Well, let's, let's do it like that. Roll in there. There. I rolled... Uh, I did eight. Okay, now... It's the same thing either way. When you roll a number, you take that number off the board. I could take the eight off... The eight by itself, or seven one, or six two. Anything that adds up to eight. Now, every number you take off the board, you win Twizzlers. It's like licorice candy. If you take all nine numbers off the board, you win $250 in prizes. Okay, now, the game keeps going until you can't make a number, and if you roll a double, you're going to get an insurance marker. I don't have those with me, so you're going to get a cyber insurance marker. Okay? We're going to know that you have one. Okay, and I'll give you a free turn if you roll a bad number. So, here are the dice. Take the roll. Roll the dice. I'll take off these numbers as you roll them. You start with a seven, a good number. Now, seven, you could take the seven by itself. Six, one, one, two, four, five, two, anything, four, three, anything that adds up to seven. One, two, four. One, two, four. And we get that one off. Okay, let's get the one. I don't even know how to do that yet. You got three Twizzlers already. Maybe you'll give one to Danny. Okay. All right. <laughs> oh. oh, well. <laughs> I see. She took 24 minutes to play a game. Nine. Oh, I thought that was a double. You can take the nine by itself and that might... Oh, no. Six, three. Six, three or nine? Six, three. Six, three. That has to be changed. What? Yeah, that has no. to be changed. Let's see. Six. Oh. No, four. Close. Five, That's no, five. Six, That's five. Hey, ding. And three. Hey, we got it. Now, you have five Twizzlers and four numbers. You take off those four numbers, and you win $250 in prizes. But we have some bad numbers. Everything over 10 is bad. Oh, no, 12 is good. Uh, 11 and 10 are bad. And six, four, four three, two, two four. and, yeah. Two is always good because it's a double, though. Yeah, some bad numbers. You don't want them. Seven is good. We have to take the seven. Okay, we'll take the seven. We'll take the seven. And that's going to give you another Twizzler. You now have six Twizzlers. Okay. But you don't have insurance cards. Get a double. Get a double four. We'll take off the eight. 
You want to help her roll, or are you going to let her do it? Let her do it. Oh! 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 There's no six. You know what that means. The game is over. But you won six Twizzlers, so that's not bad. All right? Let's go. Are we, are we saying goodbye? Are we saying goodbye? Kurt still managed television production. Stay tuned for more BCAT programming right after this. Megan, you're a tramp. Brian Fitch told me you guys made out. Everybody knows. He said your breast smells like garbage. And he almost puked. He says you're the most desperate girl he knows, besides your mom. How many boyfriends does she have anyway? Lots? Your makeup makes you look like a clown. That zit is huge, zit face. Ugly. What's up? How's it How going? You going? Guys, this is my cousin Rob from Michigan. What's up? He's a teenager. <laughs> hey, what's totally. Up? <laughs> All right. Oh, hey, you want to slow down? No. Really? Huh. Hey, you know what a beautiful animal is? A horse. A horse. Yeah. Beautiful mane. Unbelievable muscle tone. When it runs, it looks like poetry in motion. It's the most beautiful thing on earth. And sometimes when you feed a horse, its lips will tickle your hand. Just, just tickle it just a little bit. It makes me giggle sometimes. I don't know. I guess what I'm trying to say is, if you don't slow down, I'm going to bite into your head like an apple. And thanks, guys, for listening to my horse stories.